I'm ready. I am so ready. Come through. Come through. Look at that. Another one. Who's next? Who's next? Bye. How are you going to sneak in? How are you going to look over? Man, if you don't hurry up, come through. I'm ready for you. You may try and throw Mazatas at me, but I'm still going to get all of you. Ooh, 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 wait, wait, wait. I got it. Oh, wait, hold on. Up, there you go. I'm not trying to die. Oh, there's a whole bunch coming. Bye. Come on. Come through. Bye. You too. You too. Who's next? Who's next? This guy. Hold on. There you go. There you go. All right. I don't see anyone else, so... Let me see if I can get some weapons here. No? Okay. He's right through that door, too. I'm excited. I'm finally able to end all this. Seriously, though. I'm expecting a lot more people. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to the channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And hit that notification button as well so you know when I upload my videos. Oh, I hear them. One's down. If you guys just want to come up the stairs, I really don't mind. Come on. Come up the stairs, please. Come on. I mean, you could do that too. Hide, but... What good is it to you for hiding? If you want to die, just die. It's okay. See? Look at that. Come on. There you go. Alright, let me climb up the stairs. I'm not trying to get hit. Excuse me. Watch your profanity, sir. So rude. Wait, I got it. I got it right here. Just... Yeah, there you go. Oh, I'm running out of bullets. Come on, man. Thank you. That's all I need. Just, just stand up. All right, let me, let me go this way. Let me go further down. A little further down. Because they think they can get me, but they really can't. Because they suck. All right, I got one. So there is there's one person left. Excuse me. Get... Ugh, I, I hate when I lose ammo and I have to do a clip change. Definitely cuts down on the excitement. Okay, so at this point... Oh, there's a whole bunch. Excuse me. Excuse me. Don't get near. Don't... You too! Don't get near like that! Oh, snap. Anyways, why are they insisting on getting near like that? Like, bro, what's wrong with you? You really do have a death wish, huh? Trying to get to me. Come on. There you go. I got two people. Two people. Who wants to come through? Thank you. You see, y'all easy targets. Y'all making it easy for me. And for what? Why are you so hell-bent on taking me down? It's sad, really. Definitely reminds me of the ending towards Mafia 1, where Tommy Angela has to kill all of the people at the, at the church, including his boy. Alright, let me see here. Can I... Am I good? Right here, I'm gonna hide. Oh, that guy almost got me. Psych! No, he didn't. Come on. Come on. Thank you. Is he still not dead? Oh. I was about to say, this man is eating up all of my bullets. It's amazing. Okay, we should be good, right? Yep. 
We're good. I'm ready. Well, well, uh, well. Look who it is. This is where they send? This is an insult. What'd they tell you, Vito? Take care of me and all's forgiven? You really think they're just gonna let you walk after everything you did? Then again, chumps like you never do think about the big picture. And what is the big picture? But your buddy Joe understands. Don't you, Joe? What? What the fuck is this? I could ask you the same question. Loyalty is a funny thing, huh, Vito? No such thing as friendship in this business. Didn't your old pal Leo teach you that while you're sucking his cock back in the can? <laughs> you're just a fucking pawn, Vito. It's all you ever were. When are you gonna realize Joe, that? Joe, you just gotta trust me. You think I give a shit about the feds? All those tired old fucks on the commission? They're using you, Vito. Just like Clemente used you. Just like I used you. Just like that rat fuck Henry used you. You vouch for that piece of shit. Brought him into my house. And now, you dumb fuck, you're gonna pay for it. Now, Joe. Joe, trust me, hey. please. If you're gonna pull that trigger, do it already. What are you waiting for? Vito. Yeah? Let's shoot this cocksucker. Yes. On tree. You're gonna throw on. all that away? Do it! That's my boy Joe. Hey, that's my boy Joe. That's my boy Joe. Come on. I got one. Damn it, somebody kill these two psychos. Oh man, there's a whole bunch of them. Hold on. Hold on, Joe, I got you. Come on. Come on. Stop hiding! Oh, I have to get close, huh? Alright, Joe. You dumb bastard, you don't stand a chance. Come on. Yes, I can. Where you, where you at? Oh gosh, this is bad. And I'm dead. Oh, this is intense. All right, attempt number two. I'm taking my sweet time. Joe, please be careful, okay? Dang, this is worse than part one. I'm not gonna lie. Come on. Get up! You're not gonna get up? Did I really get... Did I really get you? Oh, I'm impressed. I actually got him. Alright, I got this guy. I got this guy. Somewhere. Yep, I got him. And I got him. Perfect. God damn it, somebody kill these two psychos! Psychos? Don't talk about my friend like that, jerk! Got you. You're not really bastard, you don't stand a you? chance. I you can't kill them all. Watching you die. Look at that, they're trying to psych us out. Come on, Joe. We got this. Take your sweet time. That's all I have to say. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Okay. I I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Just let me take a breather. Oh, the music is so dramatic, too. That's the crazy part. Got you. Got you. Yeah! There's only two of them. Yep, I got you. Hold on. Joe, you with me? Alright. Come on. Pop up! Pop up right now! What? Come on, where's this other guy? Oh, I can't even get him. There's only one left, right? Screw it. Oh, Reminds me of my prohibition days. Prohibition days? What? Bye, old man. Got you. You know something, Carlo? For the last ten years, all I'd done was kill. I killed for my country. Ah! I killed for my family. Ooh. I killed anybody that got in my way. That's right. Make him suffer, Vito. But this one. This one's for me. Fuck. You. And Fuck that's his famous last words. 
Joe. I sure as hell hope you know what you're doing here. Don't worry, I took care of it. You'll see. So, uh, what was he talking about back there? Nothing. He made me an offer. That's all. Yeah, I figured out that much. What kind of offer? He wanted me to whack it. Said he'd make me a capo. Give me my own crew. You know, pretty much everything I ever wanted. Yeah? So why the hell didn't you do it? Remember that five bucks you owe me? Yeah. Yeah? Am I supposed to... Okay. What the hell is this? It's all right, Joe. Is it done? It's done. Yep. All right, then. Looks like a celebration is in order. Come on. Let's head to the cat house. Sounds good to me. Come with me, Vito. There's more we need to talk about. I'll see you, Joe. All right, we'll see you over there. All right, Leo. Talk to me. All right. So what's the big secret? We're not going to the cat house, huh? Hey, hey, what the hell's going on? Where are they taking Joe? Sorry, kid. Joe wasn't part of our deal. What? You're gonna kill Joe? Wow, they're gonna kill Joe. I'm so pissed. Vito, do something. Are we not able to do anything? Save our friend? He basically didn't even kill us when he had the chance. And now we're supposed to sit back and let him get killed? Look at Joe with his, uh, lady friends. That's what I'm gonna call it. Lady friends. What the hell? Yep, Vito's arrested. He's going to prison. No, no, fuck! Everything all right, baby? Nope, This is not. Freddy's. It's Joe. Henry there. Hey, Joe. Nah, Henry ain't here. Shit. But Luca's looking for you. Hold on a sec. Admiral! Where the hell are you? I'm home. Listen, Vito just got pinched. That's why I... Already? Shit. All right, shut your mouth and listen. You remember that thing that Vito did with the gas stands, right? Yep. I just heard that somebody decided to squeal. Who was it? Some guy who works at the gas station in your neighborhood. I'll kill the fuck. No, you won't. You're just gonna send him a message for now. Let him know who he's fucking with. He ends up in a wheelchair, fine. But don't kill the guy. That's him we don't need. Got it? Yeah, I got it. You better. Come by the bar when you're done. Fuck! God damn it. Where the fuck are my pants? So, apparently, what we just witnessed was the ending of Mafia 2. And, frankly, I'm very, very angry that Joe ends up being killed. I mean, sure, some people will be like, oh, well, he deserved it for trying to two-time Vito. But, dude, he basically decided to save Vito. He decided that his opportunity was not worth losing his fan. Sorry, losing his friend. So yeah, I figured I might as well start playing the DLCs that Mafia 2 came in. And since I am mourning the loss of Joe, I figured why not try Joe's DLC first. Just so I can properly remember him. Alright, Joe. Let's, let's eat some ham and cheese. Yeah, J Jennifer Lopez styled ham and cheese. Alright, let me see what outfits he has. Hold on. I'm excited. Casual suit and raincoat? A leather jacket? Wait, that's all I have? You know what? I'm gonna take this. Ooh, okay, Joe. I see you. 
looking all damper and everything. All right, let's go. I can't wait to whack the guy who put Vito in jail. I you last night with that floozy. I ought to call the cops. You're just jealous. Uh, in your dreams, pal. Mm, like yeah, look at you. Look at you talking all that junk. You wish you wanted, Joe. But yeah, listen. You had me there for a second, Joe. I really thought you were going to kill Vito. I really did. If Vito goes down for this asshole. But the fact that you basically always had your friends back no matter what. I'm just sad that Joe had to go like that. I really am. Ooh, okay. Hey, yo, look at this. This is nice. Fancy car. All right, so we're driving a nice, cute car in the middle of the winter. I feel like this car is so 70s, though. And look at the yellow, mustard yellow. Pretty crazy, if you ask me. I still can't get over the fact that Joe dies in the end. I don't know which one's worse. Seeing Polly getting killed or seeing Joe being driven to his final moments of his life. Yeah, we didn't get to witness Joe being killed, but still, it just hurts. It hurts. After everything Joe and Vito have been through, and the audacity for Vito to just sit there and let it all happen. Fine, Vito was not able to do anything about it. But honestly, I would do anything just to make sure my friend's okay. I would have been killed Leo, shot the other guy, shot the driver, grabbed the car, and went straight to wherever spot the other car was going to. And then I'll just take my chances from there. Either I go and go into hiding, change my name, change my life, or I just go ahead yeah, and get the whole neighborhood. That's my plan. All right, Joe, what you gonna do? I can't wait. Let's beat his ass being a snitch. We need to talk. Sound good to you? Oh, look at you hitting me with a book. Look at you hitting me with the book. Joe, come on. Get up. Come on, big boy. Come on. Come on. We got this. Let's go. Where he at? So, he, look at him. Driving away? You know what? I guess I gotta go and smash the car, huh? Oh, and this was a nice car, too. Okay. Come on. There you go. Hey, big boy. It wasn't me. I swear I will stand. Please, please, it wasn't me. I didn't say nothing to nobody. You gotta believe me. It was Stan. He's the one who brought the stamps, I swear. Sorry, pal. I heard that one. I ain't lying. It was Stan who told the cops, not me. I swear. Please, please. All right, let's pretend I believe you. Ah. It's Stan right now. The shift just ended. He's heading straight to the train station, catching the 5 o'clock to Brooklyn. Ain't coming back till he has to testify. No, what's gonna happen if you're lying? I'm gonna shoot you. I'm gonna shoot your family, your friends. Ooh, look how messed up my car got. All right, train station it is. Let's go. I had to sacrifice my car to stop you from running away. This lead better be worth it, because if he's lying, it's a wrap for him and his boy Stan. I already know what happens to Vito in prison. Joe doesn't, but basically, with Joe's DLC, it leaves off with the moment that Vito is caught, he goes to prison. So while we go and see what we do to survive prison, on the other hand, we now get to play as jo Joe, and we get to see what Joe has been doing while Vito has been locked up. So I'm actually pretty excited to look forward to playing this DLC. And I'm actually glad Mafia 2 decided to create the Joe's Avengers DLC because the whole time I was dealing with the whole jail thing, 
I was wondering. I, I was actually wondering what Joe was up to. Because remember the part where Vito came back from prison and Joe was mentioning how he's been busy doing this and doing that? Well, we now get the chance to see exactly what Joe's been talking about. And apparently, the first order of business on getting busy is to nail the guy that put Vito away in prison. Oh yeah, my car is messed up. I'm not even going to front right now. It looks so ugly. It looks so ugly. Alright, so I should be good, right? Come on, copper. Come on. Alright, I should be right... Wait, this is the same trans the train station that I actually left Leo in. Oh, what a small world. Hey, Stan! Where you going? Shit! Stan! Come on, Stan! Oh, snap. Alright, let's go. Come on. Come on, Joe! You're starting to piss me off! Guys, a fucking circus freak! Alright, move! Gonna oh, God. Kill this prick. Come on, Joe! There you go, Joe. There you go. Come on. Come on, big boy. You know you can run. Come on. Oh, Stan is on a marathon here. Jump! Oh, jump. Come on. Hopefully I'll be able to catch him on time because of anything. I don't know where Stan thinks he's going. He has no place to go. And what is he doing? Hiding? Is he hiding for real? Oh, you little punk. You little punk. Get over here. You're really making me mad, bro. Like, I'm about to really beat you for being stupid. For sending my boy to prison just because you want to squeal. I can't stand people like you. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. There you go. Come on. Run, Joe, run. Get some exercise. Get your, your cardio going, man. Come on. You catching hey, this fool is a necessity. That's why he got hit. That's why he got hit. Ooh. There you go. I want you to listen real careful, Stan. You leave town tonight, and you ain't gonna come back. Fine. But it ain't gonna make a difference. The hell's Ooh. that supposed to mean? Nothing. You got yourself nine good fingers left. You wanna make it a somebody else? Somebody who knows about a lot more than just the OPA robbery. DA says he's gonna take down everybody. The DA's gunning for you. He's gonna take down your whole operation. I should kill him, huh? Who is this guy? No idea. Oh! I heard the cops. The cops are keeping him safe somewhere. Guess I wasn't important enough for that. You're not. Remember that. Now get your ass up. You got a train to catch. And don't let me see you again. If I see you again, I'm gonna kill you. Anyways. There's my cute little car that I beat up so greatly. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Anyways, where's the nearest phone booth? That's what I want to know. Ah, oh, right here. You know, I could have walked, but honestly, Joe wouldn't walk. He would have done the same thing. Lady, hurry up. Let's go. Come on, lady. Come on. Thank you. I need to make a call. You're in my way. Yep. 25 cents to make a call. Holy cow. This is Freddy's. It's Joe. Let me talk to Luca. Sure. Hold on. He's right here. It's Thank Barbaro. you. Joe. It done yet? Yeah, but there's somebody else. What do you mean? The Grease Monkey said the DA's got somebody else. Somebody who's gonna take out the whole operation. Fucking Mazio. He knew it. Who the hell's that? Richie Mazio. They picked him up last month. Guy's a retard, but he could put us all away. Fuck! All right, listen. You're gonna find out where they're keeping him. I don't care how. When you do, 
you make sure you don't talk to nobody ever again. Got it? Yeah, I got it. So did you uh, hear from Vito? Just worry about Masio. We'll take care of Vito. Look at Joe. The whole time he's been worrying about his boy. Bendito. And you know what's the sad part? They say they're going to take care of Vito. When all reality, they're just going to leave him there to rot. Hoping that he'll get killed. That's the disgusting part. But Joe doesn't know that yet. We do. Based off of the fact that I just finished the main game. We all right, so this is definitely a wild goose chase for sure. One person says it's this guy, the next guy says it's the other guy. Constantly, constantly, he said, he said, he said. Never ending, if you ask me. Never ending. I never knew there were so much rats that I had to face today. And you know what? Call me the exterminator because all these rats are going down. Oh, look at my car. Look how dirty it got already. That's insane. Alright, so the next time I play this DLC, I'm definitely going to use a different car. Because this, this car is pretty dope. A speeding vehicle. Oh, come on. Come on, Copy man. That. Are you serious? Are you serious, my boy? Leave me alone. Great, now I got the cops on me. And for what? For what? Ooh. we. Okay, awesome. I know, I'm trying to shake the cops, man. It's just pretty hard to do. Okay. I was recognized. Okay, so I guess I need to do this again. Come on, get in. I promise I won't speed as much. So corny. So corny. Maybe I should use a different car. What do you what do you guys think? I'm just trying to get there as fast as possible so I can actually deal with the situation, you know? Cause just like Joe, I'm not I'm all about let me let me slow down a little bit. I'm all about protecting my friend. Shoot, Joe was the reason why he wanted to help Vinny get a better life. Yeah, he totally went about it the wrong way. I'm not gonna lie. But it's it's the intention behind the actions. And he had good intent. I'm just sad at the fact that Joe Joe is no longer with us. First, Paulie from part one. Now, Joe from part two. Wrongful deaths. I called it all the way back a couple episodes, didn't I? When I said Vito is definitely gonna have a moment where everything is gonna crash down. Including losing mad people. And guess what? He lost Joe. Just like how he lost Henry. Just like how they both lost Marty. It's sad. So sad. Alright, I'm here. What's the matter with you? Somebody shitting your cornflakes this morning? Yeah, the captain. When he put me on babysitting food. <laughs> Take that up with the DA, pal. Star witnesses ain't too easy to come by. Besides, I can think of a lot worse than playing cards with the fellas all night. All I'm saying is, I got better things to do than babysit some wise guy stool pitch. All right, come on, just spill the beans already. You know what? Maybe you'll get lucky and a truckload of wise guys will show up, shoot the place up good. I should run them over, huh? Shoot the guy up, you know that? Yeah, don't mention it. Where are they going now? Alright, alright, I, I, I got it, I got it. Nah, I'm not losing them. So I guess I am following them, huh? Okay, say less. I like this. I wonder where they're going. I'm too close? Nah, I'm good. They're, they're just a little slow for me, that's all. 
And I love the detective music. It's cute. Totally cute. Gives off a nice little cat and mouse chase. Gives off the I'm watching you, but you don't know that I'm watching you vibes. All right, let me speed up. I'm not trying to lose them. All right, Joe, chill. We can't let them know that we're on to them. Where are these guys going? Look at that. They crashed into that taxi. That's insane. Did you guys see that? How are they not arrested? All right. So, ooh, I'm too close. Hold on. All right, good. They're going underneath the bridge. I just love how this game is showing me how to properly stalk someone without getting caught. I'm taking good notes. Okay, so at this point, I need to know exactly where they're heading to. Where are they going? In pursuit of a speeding vehicle. No. No. You, you gotta be kidding me. I was not speeding that... Man, this is crazy. I can't even do a mission without getting caught by the police. Bro, just leave me alone, okay? Just leave me alone. I'm not bothering you. Why are you bothering me? I'm just trying to complete a mission here. Look, look, aren't you guys, like, concerned that that detective actually hit the other car? No, right? No, I'm not too close. Nope. Okay. I just love how the cops... Oh, finally, the cops decided to back off. I'm happy about that. Where are these guys going? Why in this deserted place? What's the big idea? Why the secrecy? Why the... Oh, there's so many curves. I'm about to get car sickness. Or is it motion sickness? I'm not sure. Either way, I'm getting dizzy. This is too many curves. This reminds me of Puerto Rico. Where once you drive through the mountains, you're just driving in a constant circle. Because for some reason, it's impossible to create straight roads through the mountains. Where are these people? What? Here? Gotta be a way in some ways. Okay. Well, I'm ready. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.